my party We're just getting started A life is a dream or a nightmare scarring Here we go Let's see what she looks like Lots of foam on there to protect it during shipping. Alright, the very first look. Oh, I like that color. That granite gray is real nice on this thing. That's granite gray. Okay guys, here we go. First look. Electric motor right back there, it looks like. So we got the granite gray with some nice yellow stickers on it for Can Am, the Outlander, and the Electric. Nice aluminum rims. Looks pretty similar to the other Outlanders, doesn't it? It's the same Gen 3 platform for the as the Outlanders. Yeah. Just electrified. Yeah. I don't know guys, love it or hate it. Let me know in the comments. There's lots more to see. We don't normally get to see guys. There we go. That's the battery. So there's the liquid cooling down there. So the liquid cool cools the battery, cools the motor. There's a rat up front, it cools the charger. And if it's plugged in, in the winter time, if it needs to be warmed up, it'll actually provide some heat to that cooling system to warm everything up. That's really neat. The wires there, the orange wires, those are do not touch. Leave those for your tech. The battery pack is right underneath it. And as I said before, there's the water cooling. Uh, connection there. It's got a little different screen on it too, eh? Yeah, it's not a touch screen. It's not a touch screen? So we're going to see that in a few minutes, guys. We'll get that fired up. That's going to look cool too, I bet. There's the rad up front there. Yeah, it's just a Gen 3 Outlander, guys. Very similar to what we're all used to. The handlebars on the right side, we have the four-wheel drive system here. We have the regen on the front, and we have the dynamic engine modes here. Work, sport, I think it is, and there's a speed limiter mode on that as well. On the other side, that's where all the other stuff happens. You have your lights on the front there at the top. You've got your kill switch on the side there. Lighted USB port in the compartment. There's that accent light. Is that a uh, wireless charger? No, but it's just it's got a little strap that actually holds the phone right there. Oh, that's kind of neat, eh? Actually, built in little phone holder. And my phone got all kinds of a thick case and it fits no problem. Oh, look at that, guys. She's almost ready to go for her first little test run. Seats on, it's a max, granite gray, yellow stickers, yellow badging, aluminum rims, 2026 Outlander EV, max. Can't wait to see it running. Running. <laughs> This thing is interesting, guys. Even we got tech standing around to see this thing fired up. Come on now. This thing is interesting, guys. You hear anything yet? 
you hear anything? Anything at all? Woohoo, look at that, guys. Listen, watch this. And so it's not a touch, so everything you do is on the hand control. Basically, just two Like, how do you set the time? Because it was just flashing? Yeah. Well, you have to be in park and you hold the button here. Yeah, because the battery, the main battery, the drive battery yeah, is low. Down here. So yeah, I see that the there. Yeah. Each line is 10%. Okay. So right now it'd be around 20%. So you're going to take it and plug it in now? Yeah. And that's a stage two charger that we have. That's what we got all plugged in. And now it's going to give us some telemetry. Awesome. So that's the 20 to 80 percent they claim is 50 minutes, and that's 23 to 80 is in 45. So it's good to me. Awesome. Thanks, buddy.